Thanks so much for joining us for 12 News at 10. I'm Rachel Cole. I'm Mark Curtis. Tonight, Maricopa County Sheriff's detectives are still trying to piece together details after a deadly shooting in Gila Bend. We've been following this since it came in as breaking news on 12 News at 4. Team 12's Jonathan McCall is in Gila Bend with what he's learning tonight. Mark, Rachel, good evening. We do know that Maricopa County Sheriff's deputies investigating three different scenes connected to this ongoing investigation. Right now, where we're at, we're not getting a whole lot of details and information, but we know at least one person was found dead inside of a home at this location. This all started about 10 minutes from the shooting scene. Around 1 o'clock Monday afternoon, Maricopa County Sheriff's deputies received a call about a man who walked into the Gila Bend Fire Department with a gunshot wound. Around that same time, deputies say they received a call about a shooting at a home near Interstate 8 and Paloma Road. Deputies say at that scene, one person was found dead. So far, investigators have not released any details on the victims. While investigating both of those scenes, deputies were also investigating a third scene, not too far away from the shooting on the east lanes of Interstate 8. We know one person was taken to the hospital after deputies deployed a taser. Officers could also be seen guarding a black SUV on the side of the interstate. 12 News cameras also caught deputies talking to someone in the back of a truck. Investigators have yet to release any details on a possible suspect or person of interest connected to this case. The Sheriff's Office says they do plan to release more information on this investigation on Tuesday. We'll be staying in contact with them to learn of more details. In Gila Bend, Jonathan McCall, 12 News.